So people always wanted to know the experience and how it feels when certain things happen to you. And this is what you're going to see and hear today. They're going to go into details about their experience of that happening to them. I got shot nine times with an AK-47 and an AR-15. That's why I'm in a wheelchair and I actually plan on giving you guys story time. So stay tuned to hear more about what happened to me and why I'm in my chair. I would give the pain a 10. Um, a lot of people do tell you it's not that bad and things like that, but me personally, it hurt it really, 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 really bad. And I look to my left, I see, see bro walking, but then he made a juke move. And when he made that move, I went to clutch it and I realized, damn it, I left my shit in the crib. Mm. So when I did that, I looked the nigga dead in his eyes, bro. Looked him dead in his eyes. When I looked him in the eyes, now he went like this, but the grace of God, he was fumbling mm. out his gym shorts, like fumbling. So that split second, I took all run, all that pop, pop, pop. I'm running, getting hit. Boom, mm -hmm. boom. And then like, I'm running, still getting hit. Then. When it hit my thigh, my femur bone actually hit my femur, it shattered it. Boom, so I fell on the floor, so I'm back on the floor now, I'm laying down. And I'm like, I remember my dad always taught me, you ever get hit, play dead. You hit, you alive. That's any one of y'all always remember this, play dead. You yeah, know what I'm yeah. saying? So um, I got hit, I'm like, man, I got to play dead, bro. So I'm down like this, and I look up, I see the little fuck nigga running. Mm -hmm. I said, thank you, Jesus. He was scared than you yeah, were. Yeah, bro. I'm like, dang, he gone. So then I look back. I see another dude walking up to me. I'm terrified. I'm be straight yeah. up, bro. I'm terrified, bro. The dude like, nah, nah, nah. It's okay. It's okay. How many I mean, times you been shot for in real life? Four. You got shot four times. Man, it's right here. You see? One the bullet is still right there. You rub your head. Where the bullet went in at? It went in right there. It stuck right there on my bone. Then the other one. I got shot with a powder and went through that and knocked my ear out. The bullet came out right off. Damn, boy. I can see that motherfucker right now. You know what I'm talking about? I can see that one. Nigga shot me with a powder. You got shot four times? Yeah. How many times you got stabbed? Uh, three in my chest. Um, three in your chest? Yeah. God damn, Joe. Nigga, I'll show you. I ain't got to tell you. God damn, boy. How many times that is? That's nine back though. You got stabbed nine times? Yeah. Shot four times. How many times I got hit by a car? Probably about six or seven. Tip by tip, man. No. How many times? My baby mama ran over Christmas. She ran on the car. And she ran, ran over. over. You still here, boy. Hey, man. So boom, I ended up going to the store, and me going to the store, I see a little car bag then. I ain't paying no man. Car pull out. I look back, I hear boom, 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 boom. They, they hit me. When I run the store, I see my um, I see my dad at home, boy. I'm like, say, um, run me to the hospital right quick. You could tell him shot in the face. That n ain't say nothing. That n gave me it look like, like, n you still alive? I see somebody else coming down the street. I'm like, um, run me to the hospital right quick. He telling me I ain't got no insurance on my car. Mm. I'm like, what? Going to the house with my grandma. I'm like, my mom just got shot. Physician, she look, she stuck like. Psh. Couldn't really say that. Yeah. My auntie like, what's going on out here? I look her way, my face, my face so split open, bust open. I look at her, she pass out, boom, hit the ground. My dad ended up pulling up on the way to the hospital. We ended up catching the flat on the way to the hospital. We gotta get out this car, get in the car that was following behind us. When we get to the hospital, I'm telling the doctors, the mom like, I just got shot. They like, just looking. Everybody like, I'm like, what is y'all doing? Now this particular person right here, they basically robbed him while he had the stuff on him. So his situation was a little different. He already had it on him. You know, they robbed him, they did what they did. He had it on him, he said his pride got in his way and he started following them, walking up behind them and that's when they turned around and you know what. Alright bro. A lot of people want to know how I got this scar on my neck. All right, listen, listen, I'm going to tell you. First and foremost, it's because I got shot. I got shot in the neck. Uh, I almost died and whatnot, but that's cool. That's cool. But what happened was, bro, me and my baby mama, me and her, we was going back and forth. You know, we, was, we weren't on the best of terms, all right? So I was staying with her. I was staying with her and her folks. But then I had got so tired of the, the drama and all the mess, so I decided to leave. I'm from Georgia, I, and they live in Florida. So I, I got a bus ticket, I'm about to leave, I'm about to go home. All right, boom. 
All right, boom. So I got the ticket or whatever. I'm waiting. I'm waiting to go home. I packed my bags. Her mom helped me pack my stuff, and I'm waiting on. I'm waiting to go to the bus station. All right, so so I go back over to to the to the side of the house that me and my baby mama we was you know we occupy that that side of the house. So I go from her mama's side. I go to our back to our side. So goddamn, I'm just sitting there. I'm just sitting there thinking, cause like I really don't want to leave, but I but I gotta leave. You feel me? So, like, all of a sudden, I see, I ain't gonna get into too much detail because it's like, it's a lot going on, but basically, but I, I see, I see these, these, these folks, I see these folks, they walking up on me. So, I, I ain't think nothing of it because I see them all the time. I see them all the time, so I don't, I don't really care. So, all of a sudden, they up, they up their guns, they, you know, they, they rob me, you feel me? So like a like a sensual person, I give up my stuff, you know what I'm saying? No harm, no foul. Then I just got to sit. I, so I sat back down after they robbed me, and I was and I was just thinking, I'm like, damn. But it just did me like that. So my pride, it was really my pride. My pride is it made me get up and follow them. So I'm following them. I got I got my, you know, I got my 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 little my little five. So I follow them. So as I'm following them, I'm contemplating a lot of stuff. Um, should I shoot these boys? Should I just start busting at them down the street? Um, should I walk up on them and do them like that? So, but I never whipped out my pistol though. The whole time I'm walking behind them, I never whipped out my pistol. So, so I get up on him. I get up on him. It's two of them. I get up on them, and I'm just. And it's just a stare down, you know what I'm saying? Cause like they they know, you know that these boys they did a bare they bare face. These, these boys they in jail, so I, you know what I'm saying? It ain't no, ain't no. Oh, I'm telling who the not. They 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 got caught. It's on camera. Everything I'm telling y'all, this on camera. But so we so it's on so we staring each other down and stuff. I, I they got they they I know, I know. Okay, I ain't gonna say that part. Okay, but anyways, they like. So I, I'm I'm upset, bro. I'm I'm upset. I'm I'm yelling. I'm actually doing a lot of yelling, bro, because I don't want to shoot these boys. Really, I really don't want to do that because I don't want to go to jail or none of that stuff. And I and bro, it, it take a lot to take somebody's life. So I'm but I'm still I'm something still made my body get up and walk after them. So we stand each other down, and then all of a sudden, I get into it with my baby mama. My baby mama, she she there, she in the vicinity, she is in the area. So. I start, I start, I turn to her and I start whoopy, whoop, 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 you know what I'm saying? And so when I turn, when I turn my um my back to them for whatever reason, I don't know what was on my mind, but I turn, I didn't, I ain't turn my back. Okay, I'm facing them, and I turn to her like on the side, like this. And all of a sudden, I don't even know if it was on if I turn to the side or if I turn all the way around, but all of a sudden. I heard a pop, pop sound. just like that, like like a firecracker, pop. It was a, like I got shot with a twenty-two. As you can see, the little um little bullet wound where it came out. It came, it went in my neck right there and came out my mouth. So I I heard a pop, and all of a sudden, I like when I as, as I heard it, I felt a push on my neck. So I, I I run, I stumble, I'm stumbling, and then I fell to the I fell to the ground like you know. So so I'm on the ground or whatever. I'm on the ground, whatever. Um, and then part two, part two, part two.